Hi everyone, Anissa Coy here, and I'm going to show you guys how to clean family pictures that have been um, in a fire or other situation and books. So we're going to get right down to business here. We're going to use a chem sponge, a dry cleaning sponge, and what you do is we're going to lay out some paper towels so we have a nice clean area, surface. We're going to lay our contaminated pictures here in a stack. And depending on how many pictures you have to do, this can be quite a process, so you're going to want to have a system like this going. So what I do is I wear a pair of gloves when I'm handling the picture because I don't want to get my oils from my fingers on the picture. So you want to hold the edge of the picture and take your dry cleaning sponge and swipe it across the picture. Move your hands over to the other side of the picture and swipe your cleaning sponge on the picture. I don't know if you can see, but there is just a very little tiny bit of soot that came off those pictures. Now I'm going to flip the picture over to a clean surface and do the same thing again on the back side. This will pull all the smoke and soot particles off the picture and leave it nice and clean. Now you're going to go through this process again with each picture. And believe it or not, the picture can be pretty black and I can get smoke and soot, all the smoke and soot off of it with these chem sponges. They're pretty amazing. Alright, so you just do this no matter what size the picture is. And now you have clean processed pictures. Okay? And then you can put them in a Ziploc baggie or back into a photo album or whatever. Um, now I'm going to show you how to do a book. So this particular book um, has a cover on it that we would take off. And um, the first thing we would do then is HEPA vacuum all of the surface area and the binding and the surface area here of the book. And then I would take my dry cleaning sponge and do exactly the process I just did on all the pictures. I would rub it across the surface of the entire book cover, both sides. Okay, then I would flip it over and do the same on the back side. Now I'm going to process the book. So now here I have this book that's already been HEPA vacuumed off, and I'm going to run my chem sponge along the top of the book, edges, front, and bottom. Okay. You're going to find most of your dirt or soot right up here on this part of the book. Then I'm going to do the same process with the front and back of my book and just barely on the insides of the bindings and front cover of the book. Then I'm going to do the same on the back of the book. Okay. Once your chem sponge gets dirty like this, you're going to want to get a new one because that will recontaminate your surface area. And that is how you clean pictures and books.